with astronauts Barry Butch Wilbur and Sunita Sunny Williams, secure inside Boeing's Starliner spacecraft, teams provide final confirmation of rocket and crew readiness. Then, the RD-180 engine and two solid rocket boosters produce nearly 1.6 million pounds of thrust to lift ULA's Atlas V rocket away from Cape Canaveral Space Launch Complex 41. Shortly after liftoff, the rocket begins a pitch over to attain the proper flight path while minimizing the pressure it experiences during flight. Atlas then reaches Mach 1, the speed of sound. To ensure crew safety and comfort, the vehicle rolls to a heads-up position and uses booster engine throttling to limit vehicle acceleration to 3.5 Gs. With propellant expired, the SRBs burn out, followed by jettison. Atlas V's guidance system then activates to steer towards the precise target in space. First stage flight continues as the crewed rocket crosses the Kármán line, entering space. With the majority of propellant expended as Atlas fights against the force of gravity, the RD-180 engine shuts down and the booster stage separates. The ascent cover is then jettisoned after protecting critical hardware on top of the spacecraft and providing an aerodynamic shape for ascent through the atmosphere. With the rocket now weighing less than 9% of what it did at liftoff, dual RL-10A engines on ULA's Centaur upper stage ignite. Following engine start, the aeroskirt is jettisoned. The ULA-designed aeroskirt extends the Starliner's surface, enhancing its aerodynamic characteristics and stability, and minimizing the loads of this unique crewed configuration. With the first burn complete, the Centaur engine shut down, entering a suborbital coast phase in preparation for separation. Centaur's trajectory design enhances crew safety by providing a shallow orbit more favorable for an abort if required and ensures the Centaur will naturally deorbit, impacting the ocean off the southwest coast of Australia. Centaur then releases the CST-100 Starliner spacecraft as Sonny and Butch continue their journey to the International Space Station. <laughs>